It's all chaos. Bunko made an appearance at the square. I heard that the rebel leader, Mr. Fig, has been dispelled. Don't listen to rumors. Last I heard, she didn't force her herself. Rolling about being friendly with Mr. Fig. It's better if we don't take sides in this war. Well, we'll have to do it sooner or later. been here before. An engineer called Daisy lives here. She was designing a rocket last time I spoke to her. Come on, there's an exit at the top of the staircase. Well, we can't get through here. I wonder if Bonku caused this mess. We can probably climb Daisy's rocket and get out that way. devoured us. Don't you see? They're not lost pieces anymore. Well, how nice for them. Bye! Take care! All right. Can we move on now, please? At least we're safe now. Let's hope they find some peace. You have some powerful friends, Anne. I'm not sure. It must have been the caretaker. <laughs> Remember the last time we were here? Don't remind me. It wasn't that long ago. Feels like another life. Come on, follow me. security at two stations, not to mention that lunatic gun for Gottling. Chief Inspector Magnum, I can handle him. We'll pretend you're my prisoner and he'll let us in, no questions asked. Of course, the gun nut will just let us straight through. Will you trust me for once? I think you owe me that. All right, fill me in on the details, please. If I told you now, you'd refuse to go. Very encouraging. Hi, it's the 
Fawcett and Rebel Leader outside. Who is it? I want to see two. Is he killing him? Not sure what they're doing. Hey, Billy, go back to your room now. Magnum's gone mad. He's detaining just about everyone he meets, ever since he heard the enforcers switch sides. I don't think I can make that jump. Come on, Anne. You can do it. Just aim for my hand.
take another round. Yes, sir. Look, Magnum's there. Don't worry. I have a plan, remember? About that, isn't it about time you explain the details? The plan is, we jump down there and I distill you. What? We pretend that I went undercover to catch you. And to prove that I'm really on Bonku's side, I distill you in front of everyone. I was distilled once and that's more than enough. Let's just pretend that... Magnum needs to see me distill you. He has no clue that I can bring you back now. I'll revive you as soon as we're on board the train to the tower. You promise? I trusted you with my life once, didn't I? What do you want me to do? We jump down in front of everyone, and I say something like... Mr. Fig, I finally found you. Prepare to be distilled. And you say... Stay your hand. The darkness of your Arca shall never reach my soul. Long live the freedom fighters. <laughs> yes, exactly. I knew you had an actor in you. That was perfect. Really? You think so? Absolutely. Then I distill you, bring you on the train, and revive you. All right, let's get to it. was on an undercover mission for Bonku and never was on my side after all. She sure fooled me. The end has come for you, Mr. Fig. I will now. So, this is how it ends. The terminus of my life has arrived taking the form of an adolescent damsel. Observe. How the Lady of Anima prepares my inescapable doom. Fig, what are you doing? I have arrived at my day's cataclysmic conclusion. Be quiet. I shall now... Oh... You knew what I have seen with these, my eyes, what I have felt with these, my hands, what I have smelled with these, my nostrils. Never again shall I perceive any sensation of the. No, you shall not, because I'm distilling you now. What will be after the Anima Sectomi? What will I become? To which destiny have my feet taken me? Had I but listened. Had I but seen the true way and bent to the will of Master Banku. No, I mustn't think like so. Not even in this, my final hour. Will I doubt my evil rebel ways? Yes, I am evil. I have seen the mirrors that are my eyes, touch the darkness in my heart. Do I deserve this destiny? Truly. Alas, 
my fate is in her hands. Will she distill me soon? I must wonder. trips into town. Doesn't get any better than this. I can't remember the last time I felt this calm. No rebel can reach us here. You sure can't. You said no rebel could reach us here, right? That's right. We're completely safe. What, with you here? And me, of course. And me! Suppose a rebel did strike. What would you do? Well, I would hurry out of this lounge and conduct a good old search and destroy with them. I see. Sir, Imp and Plumbum can take care of everything. Just stay in here and relax. Oh, 
plan like this needs to be thought out carefully. You succeeded. The fire of the rebels has been extinguished forever. I can't express my gratitude enough, madam. You're such an inspiration to me. To us all. On one side, we had the dirty rebels hiding underground. And on the other, you, the eye in the sky. The queen of anima. Oh, never mind my ramblings. What was I talking about? Rebels. Yes, damn rebels. Glad we're rid of them. That was the point I was getting at. Thank you. 
gotta get downstairs. Get them! Catch them! Distill them! One of us should stay with you, Madam Enforcer. Who do you prefer? Me or Amp?
Wonderful. And the bad news is that Magnum, Amp, and that big brute Plumbum are on the train with us. Never mind. T-Man and Vic can solve that. Just let me out. Well... That's the bad news, isn't it? Plumbum put a huge cargo box on top of you. It's too big for me to move. You can leave me in this box? Once we reach the station, I'll get you out. I promise. Then why did you revive me now? You could have just waited. Oh. I didn't think of that. I can just distill you again. Wait a moment. No, no. Two times is twice too many. Just do what you have to do. See you soon, Fig. Please don't forget about me. the rebels, madam? Yes, I caught them. You did? Wow, amazing job once again, madam enforcer. Where are those nasty rebels? Thank you very much. Well, what did you do with those dirty rebels? I threw them off the train. Yes, whoosh, off they went. Oh, madam, you truly are one of a kind. They had it coming. Here we are, Tower Ground Station. Let's unload that jack and ape in a box. I need to get to the tower as soon as... I'm the station master now, and I don't have to take orders from you. Don't you recognize the great enforcer? Oh, is that so? Master Bunku personally informed me that your great enforcer aided the rebels in their attack on the plant. Oh, whatever it was, I'm sure it was part of a cover story. She destroyed the entire plant! You really want me to believe that? You think the enforcer would have lied to me this whole time? Taking advantage of my professional admiration of her? We have a witness and mirror documentation placing the Enforcer at the scene at what turned out to be the most serious rebel attack in Realm history. Oh, I'm sure the Enforcer can explain. Well, it's clear that the problem here is, in fact, the explanation is straightforward. trust anything you say, Secti. No one officially appointed you Station Master. But after Pax was gone, I assume... How dare you question my loyalty to Master Banku? Well, uh... Officer Magnum, please escort Secti to the Central Station and question him so we can uncover the source of his betrayal. I'll make sure you receive a promotion. A promotion? But I'm already Chief Inspector. I'm sure we can find a title better fitting for your stunning talent and wit. That would be a dream come true, Madam Enforcer. I'll question Secti right away. You've always been my most trusted officer. Thank you, Madam. Right away, Madam. We'll get to the bottom of this. Come along, Secti. But, M- Madam Enforcer. Quiet.
tower is off limits. It's me, Tiffany. Anne? Hey, Tiff, would you open the gate, please? Anne, Master Bonku locked himself in his tower. I tried to call him on the mirror, but something cut the transmission. I don't know what to believe. First, I heard you went over to the rebel's side. Then I heard it was all an undercover mission. I've known you my whole life, Anne. You owe me the truth. Which is it? is it? Open the gate, please, or I'm afraid I'll have to shorten that cord of yours. Anne, how could you do this to me? Sorry, Tiffany. And you betrayed Master Bonku, too. I'm trying to solve this. I feel sorry for you, Anne. I'm sorry you forgot what we had together. And I'm sorry you lost faith in those who gave you everything. Goodbye, Tiffany. I'll miss you. Leave me alone. gave you a job that no one could finish in a lifetime. You think so? Please, Pavel. Spend your time on something you love. Well, it has been a while since I visited Cousin Bolster. Maybe I'll take a few days off. Right after I finish this panel. See you around, Madam Enforcer. Let's hope so.
up the head. Let me take care of this. No, that didn't do it. Maybe there's a switch somewhere. must have cut the flow from his anima reserve. Well, this is nice. Great view, good closet space, and what, uh, three floors? And a balcony. Huh, impressive. I'm not crazy about the neighborhood, though. There's, there's a distilled forgotten here. I know. It's Dilly. I knew him. He broke in. I had to make a choice. I know. It's all right.
Walter? What happened? Mr. Fig, what are you doing here? Oh, I, I mean, who are you? I don't know you. I'm a welder at the workshop. Relax, Dilly. It's a long story, but the point is Anne is on our side now. She brought you back. Who? How? We're making our way into the tower to talk Bonku out of escalating this conflict further. You're going for the secret entrance like we planned? Yes. Right. What can I do? Bulb and his cohorts will arrive as soon as we've disabled the security systems. Help them get through here. You can count on me. Dilly, I'm sorry for what I put you through. Don't mention it. We all do better when we know better. at the same time.
years. Hmm. Which way do we go? Up. Up it is. This is the core chamber. Banku taught me how to use the Arca to operate the service lifts. I used to play here. Uh, not exactly a safe playground. Banku didn't know, of course. It didn't used to be this cold in here. Looks different, too. The lifts will take us to Banku's private rooms. Before I got my own place, this is where I used to live. From there, we can access the control room and turn off the security system so Bulb can get in. What if Banku won't listen to reason? Then he'll turn on the ether bridge. But he'll listen. I know he will. But I'm afraid I may have to face him alone. In Banku's eyes, you'll always be the one who turned me against him. Whatever you need, Anne.
can't think of anything. Did you really work at the plant? I actually designed parts of it. Back then, I thought it would be a power plant producing animal from crystals. And when you found out what it was? I knew I had to stop it. Not just the plant, but the as well. I explained my thoughts to Rin, the supervisor of the plant, remember? How could I forget? We were pretty close back then. She ratted me out. Before I knew it, I was stripped of my validation sticker and had to escape the plant, chest over heels. Then what? I found a place on the ground, and a few like-minded companions. Bob wanted your arc, but I was sure you'd join our side what you saw, what you saw. It was risky. It was, didn't it? I guess we'll find out. He'll be at the atrium at the very top, with his ether bridge. Pretty photo. I'd stand on that balcony every night, close my eyes, and feel the rain on my face. I had no idea Bonku took this photo. It's from the day I moved out. You know he got me a bike for my birthday once? It was this horrible old thing he found who knows where. I loved that bike. First time I rode it was in here. I knocked over a desk and two lamps.
Fig, what if he won't listen to me? Take a look at this place, Anne. You're his whole life. You just need to remind him. private study. I was never allowed in there. I was never allowed in here. This is the place closest to the ether. Bonky went in here when he wanted to think and be alone. All these stories from the ether gathered in the same room. This must be the closest thing to the human world you can get without actually being there. Why didn't he let you in here? He never told me. to the atrium. It won't move. We have to shut down the security systems before we can go up. The door to the security room is in here somewhere. security systems from here. Depleters, gate controls, mirrors, you name it. Let's get to it. There's a bunch of switches. I'll take the one up there. 
Drag this out any longer. Let's go. Peace. You think you can keep me trapped in here? <laughs> 
Tick-tock. It'll hold, little Anne. Stop it! It leads nowhere. Tick-tock. You must see that. Wake up, little Anne. Wake up. What? What did you just say? Tink, is it you? You know that monster? It's not a monster. She used to be my alarm clock. That thing? She was smaller back then. Oh, Tink, what has he done to you? I am his master. From his work desk, I have seen him unlock the potential animal. Tick, tuck, and tame the arc. I witnessed him overcoming the laws of crystallization. You taught me how to tell time and woke me up every morning. I have evolved. I am no longer subject to forgotten weaknesses. The master gave me arms to turn the pages of his books. He connected me to platform so I could lift him. I grew and grew. Today, I am the very tower all around me. One morning, you were just gone. I thought you crystallized. I cried for a week. The master wanted me to be a secret. I am his final sheep. I'm not his enemy. I'm his family. I've watched you grow up. I am one with the tower, the pipes, and the anima. I've always sensed you. Every time you've stood by a communication mirror, I've seen you. I've heard you. I've heard you. I know you, Anne. You think you know me? You don't. Don't be so sure. Tick tock. Time tells all. Useless. No, no need to try, little Anne.
Do you really think you can change him? Do you think you know what is right and wrong? Nothing is black or white. There is only black. Tick tock. Only more darkness. Every time you forgive someone, you encourage, you encourage them to betray you again. Do you see, Anne? Everybody's looking out for themselves. 
What will you do now? Does it still me? I can't distill you, Tink. There must be another way. To whom am I speaking now? Are you, are you Anne, Anne the Rebel? Or, or are you the Anne I used to know? I'm still the Anne you used to know, Tink. Anne, we need to get going. If she won't move, make her. Are you hearing this? Think anymore. I need to hear what she has to say. You will listen to me. I need to know more. And I want to help you. Why? If I can understand you, then maybe... You think you can understand yourself through me?
Always be 